everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so blessed. Today I am going to be making an avocado burger. And I'm, right now I'm going to be cutting up my onions so I can get them going. I have a white onion here. So I'm just going to cut this and I'm going to caramelize it. So yeah, it's been a while. I'm trying to, you know, make my channel be more consistent with the things that I do because I love to do arts and crafts and create things and I know I've mentioned this before but it's like I gotta get like consistent with this I want to pick certain days that I do arts and crafts um, share when I'm doing fragrances I want to do days that I cook <clears throat> and I also would like to just have a day where anything goes, whatever I talk about, wherever I go. I'm going to check on my ground beef and I will get back with you guys shortly. They're looking pretty good and they're smelling so divine. I just got my ground beef. I'm going to grab that, season it, and... Um, put it in this pan here okay so normally I would use an egg as my binder but I'm not doing that today I'm going to use these plain bread crumbs and I'm gonna put a little bit of that in there <clears throat> and I'm gonna add some salt and then I'm going to add some onion powder Then I'm going to add garlic powder and then some pepper. I'm going to grab some red chili flakes and something else. Hold on. Okay, here are the red chili flakes. I'm going to add a little bit of this in there, not too much. And then I'm going to add which I crushed up already, my Maggie cube. Sprinkle some of that in here because I already, whew, I already have the salt in here. So we'll do that. I don't want too much. That's good enough. So now I'm just going to smush this together. And I know that um, adding the egg makes the, um, burger turn this fire up makes the burger more <clears throat> uh, stick together push these onions down here okay now I'll add a little more oil here and I'm gonna make my burgers let's split it in two Like so. Okay. Let that cook. And I'll do the same. Like this that is left over. Smash it up. Mix it up a little bit. And I'm just going to go ahead and let that cook. All right. Go ahead and get these going like that. And we're going to flip this burger. Yeah. Just like that. Okay, okay. I'm gonna add a little bit more salt, just a little bit. I didn't put a whole lot of salt on. I don't think I did, it didn't look like it to me anyway. And we're gonna go ahead and let this cook down. And then I'll be back to show you what it's gonna look like. 
Okay, okay, okay. My burger is ready. I have some fries here, some little curly fries. I microwaved them because I didn't want to have all the extra grease. Oh, by the way, I do not like bread like that. I do not like hamburger buns. They're just too bready, too, too much. And I love to put this barbecue sauce on my fries. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Yep. What time is it? It is almost six o'clock. Perfect time because I love to watch the Flintstones. I'm gonna come on at six. So we have the um, avocado that I made, guacamole, whatever. It has onions and peppers and tomatoes and some seasoning in it. Oops. So I'm just gonna scoop some of that on my bread, Ooh. on my bread like so. Yeah, so I just took the avocado, of ripe avocado, cut it up with some onion and some tomato, salt, pepper, lime, squeezed it, smashed it up all together. And then I put it in the fridge. And now I am going to add some onions on the bottom. Oh, now you're showing you. I'm, I had some on, the, the onions I did. See these onions here. Adding it here. Taking the burger. Oh, I need some for the next burger. This is my um, avocado burger, and uh, it is so so good. If you've never tried it, try it. So good. So delicious. I'm going to taste it. Yeah. Okay, we're ready. <laughs> so good. So good. Mm. So good. Thank you for watching. I hope you try this avocado guacamole burger at home for you and your family. I'm sure you will love it. It is so good, so very delicious. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Blessings.